Okay, so today I'm going to show you something a little bit different, a little bit fun, um, and something that can probably save a little bit of money. Uh, adding subtitles to videos is usually a little bit expensive. It's usually outsourced. You send it out, you get them to put all the text in, they send you back some videos that have the subtitles in them. Um, it's actually really easy to do with Google Drive. So as an example, we have a movie here that um, when it plays, you can see there are no subtitles. So um, what we can do is create a basic little text file. So you start off with the number of just increasing order number then your time you're going um, hours minutes seconds and then you need this funky little dash dash greater than and then when it ends and then the next line is your text so we'll just throw one more in there really simply zero 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 eight two zero 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 eleven and this is the third piece text. So then what you want to do is you want to actually save it. And how you want to save it is by changing the extension to SRT. Um, in this case, I already had it created, so I'm just going to replace it. So now that you got that fancy little text file with this in here, you go back to your video and in Google Drive, down the right side where it normally says activity, you want to flip over to details. And if you scroll right to the bottom, there's caption tracks. So click on the little pencil and you can add a new caption track. So choose the file. In this case, it's our test.srt. You can choose what language the actual track is in, and you can actually optionally give it a name. We'll just call this one English Titles. And you hit Upload. And we're done. So you hit Done. You can add more if you want while you're here. Uh, if you come back, you can actually edit them, download the one that's there so that you can work on it, and then put it back up, um, or delete it. So now, when we open the movie, there's our subtitles. And you can change between the languages down here. It's as simple as that.